in and out faster than you can say. Blathering blatherskite! Uh, here we go. Not so fast, you foul agent! Unhand that electronic disruptor or face Gizmo justice! Right, Gizmo Duck? Um, yes! I'm afraid that doesn't belong to you, Agent D. Oh, and I'm afraid I don't care. Ha! No mere marble can stop you! Ah! Incredible! Innovational! Ah, diabolical! You remember you can fly, right? Yes, of course! I'll just... Hey, I drop this into the water and the resulting shockwave will short-circuit all of Duckburg. You wouldn't dare. She dared. Dog, oh, man! She got away! But we kept Fowl from getting that dangerous disruptor. And I've got a feeling we haven't seen the last of Gendra D. Dr. Intern, what are you doing at the lab so late? I was just pulling an all-nighter because I can't quite figure out this experiment because I'm not nearly as smart as you because you're so smart. Sounds about right. Don't blow anything up. Phew. Finally alone. Uh, uh, Mama! You're still awake? I'm your mother. I don't sleep until you do. Why aren't you at home? Just working late. Que raro. Because I talked to your co-worker, the horse thing, and he said you hadn't been in the lab all day. <laughs> don't listen to Manny. His heart is in the right place, but his eyes are made of statue. Are you seeing someone? What? No! I... Oh, no, a dangerous lab accident. But not so dangerous, you need to come check on me. Talk later, Mama. Bye! Sorry, Mama. I can't tell you what's going on. Not yet. Do you think they bought it? Of course they bought it. Well... Mama sounded suspicious and I can hear my heart beating so loudly that I think other people can hear it, but... Oh, oh suit. I'm gonna choose to believe your heart's beating for me and take it as a compliment. Ahem. Huey! Fed! I'm sorry to interrupt. Whatever you were doing, but I was searching the docks and found a piece of Agent D's clothing embedded with nanites. Agent D, you say? If we can reverse engineer their signal, it could lead us right to her. Hey, what are you working on? Oh, nothing. It's really not at all revolutionary or earth-shattering or even a little brilliant. Did you create a virtual reality cloud space? With thought-based environmental manipulation? Can I see it, please, please, please? I'd love to. You can only access it through a VR helmet, and the gizmo helmet only responds to me. Ah, if only I... Thank you, Manny. How convenient. No! Can we stop? You don't understand! Whoa. Amazing! Incredible! What the foul? Ah! Gendry D, how did you get in here? A place we've never been in together. Villain? Uh, you're such a bad liar. He was lying? Wait, Fenton, are you working for Gandra D? No, not working for, working with. But she's a foul agent. Are you a foul agent? What is happening? Ah! What's this? Some evil foul trap? No, it's a weighted blanket. It helps with anxiety. Well, it can't stop me from being anxious! I... I... Curses. I'm totally relaxed now. I can't believe you let someone in. It was an accident. But he's not gonna judge us. Huey, Gendra and I have been working on the Gizmo Cloud in secret. Together. But she's an evil cyborg. Yeah, this kid seems real judgment-free. <sighs> My whole life, I've tried to push the boundaries of science, but that means people don't always get what you're doing. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Super science can be dangerous. It's why I ended up having to experiment on myself and why the only people who would fund my work are villains who don't care how much destruction I cause. But what if there was a lab where you could perform any experiment with no chance of anyone getting hurt? Ah! 
no one gets hurt because it's all virtual. If you have an idea, you can make a gizmo. We could share it for free. Bring super science to the world. No, you attacked us. You stole stuff for foul. I've been tipping Fenton off to stop me before I do. I'm using their resources to build this place. Once it's done, I can quit Foul for good. We're so close to finishing, but the lab keeps glitching. If Dr. Gearloose or Foul discovers us before it's ready, they may shut us down. Then I shall keep your secret, because I believe in science, but I also believe in lab!